All right, gonna do the same drive I've done pretty frequently to local coffee shop. Creeping up for visibility. can in the car, navigates it well. This is the route that has the unprotected left turn that I do a lot, but we're actually going to be turning right on it. It's still, it's a turn that doesn't have good visibility on the left. There's a hill and trees that block the view. So I'm always interested to see how it handles the first turn. coming and it's gonna have to creep forward. I'm always ready to take over at this turn. stopping to begin with there's something going on but I handled it well it was an unexpected stop traffic stopped car adjusted so far no disengagements
Nothing's changed because it struggled with that before and it just handled that really well. That was a nice improvement. I've done this trip on some of my other videos. If you saw them, that's often a spot where the software would get tricked up. You see it picking up trash cans, cars, traffic cones. It's pretty amazing what the software is able to recognize. All these cars are cars parked in driveways along the road. A lot of them it sees before I see them. Tucked away. It's an advantage of cameras surrounding the car looking everywhere at once. I was just commenting on somebody's post on Twitter today that oftentimes the car does a better job of seeing things than I do particularly bad rain or in the dark, the car's often seeing better than I can. It also reacts faster than a human can in a lot of cases. There's a lot of times where I've been driving like this and all of a sudden the car will swerve a little bit to the right and I'll think something's wrong. And then you see afterwards my delayed reaction was there was a car that was coming over into the lane and it just adjusted and moved out of the way for it. And not that that's super impressive by itself, but the fact that it does it before I recognize it, I think speaks to the long-term safety of this system. It's got a ways to go, but if it can start reacting faster than a human, which it does in most cases now, I think that's gonna lead to safer roads for everyone.